Hello all, today in this video, I am going to provide details regarding Anspringer Scopus in text journal uh, which takes only less time for first decision and uh, we can, uh, I'm just moving this journal from the Scopus preview page to check whether this journal is in Scopus or not. It, at, while I'm making this video, this journal is in Scopus but uh, if you are me taking this uh, we, uh, journal from some other time means please check whether this journal is in scopus at that particular in time since you may know uh, time to time scopus will be removing some journal so we can move to the journal which is applied intelligence it is an springer publication journal and you can see the scopus coverage here is from 1991 to present and moreover the subject area is computer science related to artificial intelligence and source typers journal so then we can see the scopus content coverage to check how many documents this journal has published so far so to, this is to check whether the journal is in clone journal or not so in 2022 only this uh, journal has uh, published nearly 1700 documents but if you see in uh, previous year means it has come uh, uh, published only less number of documents in every year it is just increasing so in 2023 also it may increase so then we can move to the source home page of this journal so this is the details regarding this uh, journal uh, so applied intelligence so it this journal is now published 15 times year per year so that is it is having nearly 15 issues so if you want to read more regarding this journal means please check this link to uh, know more about this journal as of now this journal is covering some subtopics related to artificial intelligence like uh, neural networks and uh, uh, real life manufacturing defense management government and industrial problems so it's an hybrid journal so apart from that you can see the impact factor the five-year impact factor and you can also see the submission to first decision is 19 days uh, so the first decision will be happened within 19 days itself so then we can move to the indexing details of this journal already we saw it's indexed in scopus apart from that uh, it's indexed in ugc science citation index then science citation index expanded etc so then uh, this journal we can see how many issues this journal is going to cover already we saw it's uh, publishing nearly 15 issues per year moreover we can just see in this link to check how many articles this uh, uh, journal is publishing per how many issues this journal is publishing per year so In 2022, as they have uh, uh, given in their homepage, nearly it is having 15 issues. In uh, 2021, it was ha happen uh, happening nearly only 12 issues, but in 2022, it's uh, having nearly 15 issues. So, in 2023 also, it will have nearly uh, 15 issues. Then we can move to the uh, uh, journal which which is published in this. Uh, um, journal to check uh, just uh, what is the dates regarding the submission received and publication to just know an approximate date of the acceptance date uh, then uh, published dates etc so uh, the, here they haven't mentioned the revision uh, that is submission date but accepted in november 2022 and published in march 2023 so all uh, you may know that standard publications like springer all will take nearly uh, minimum six months to uh, three to uh, six months and maybe more also to publish after acceptance this thing you from this thing you may know how much uh, time a journal will take from acceptance to publication some in in some journals they would have mentioned the uh, dates regarding the 
uh, submission also so from that you may check how many approximate dates a journal is taken for acceptance and publication so this approximate dates may differ why i'm saying approximate because we can't in a journal we can't say very confirm how many days it takes for acceptance or publication it's just an approximation uh, so based on that uh, we can just make an uh, approximate date uh, so uh, this approximate date also differs based on the review reviewer's availability. Sometimes if uh, reviewers is high means it uh, takes only less time. But uh, if it does not means uh, it may take some high time. So this is the details regarding this journal. So if you are interested in this artificial intelligence corpus UGC SCI SCIE index journal means uh, please uh, check the link which we have shared in the description box. We have shared only little details regarding this journal. So thank you.